Well, we already had most things spaced out here, but this year we particularly had to pay attention to how we could space things out. So we have 150 acres, so space isn't a huge factor for us, but I wanted to make sure, you know, even like as we set out our benches, I was making sure that they were like six feet away from everything so people can still sit and not be on top of each other. Well, the season kind of kicked off big by offering the curbside service in March. Customers got in a different routine and we found that they got in a habit of doing their regular grocery shopping here. You know, not just coming for the peaches or the apples, but getting up all their produce and you know, their eggs and their milk and their meat. And we just feel like our regular customer base has really grown as far as just, you know, every day to day customer walking in and just getting carts full of groceries. So we have your pick your own pumpkin patch here behind us. And then we have several activities, you know, for kids to do. This year we built a big pavilion you know, for people to sit under and eat. We also built a big tractor playhouse and trailer that has a big slide. We have several other activities like slides and swings and you know, we're, we're always thinking of what else we can add to it. We're also doing all of our events by reservation only and that helped us kind of spread people out so not everybody's coming all at one time. We did that with the pick your own crops and then we also did it with the pumpkin patch now. So they're going onto our website and booking their reservation and that way we can set a limit on how many people can come at different times. Not a lot has changed in what we offer, just more of for our staff going through and cleaning things. Things that have changed on our end is demand is extremely high. Um, other than that, it's a lot of cleaning at the end of the day, more than what we'd normally do, sanitizing every single thing that people touch. We're seeing a lot more people coming out for fruits and vegetables, um, their regular groceries. We're doing curbside service, which is taking a little bit more work with inventory and ordering. You know, friends are meeting here to go out and just get outdoors, especially with the pick your own berries. We saw a lot of ladies meeting here to go pick together. People are just wanting to come out to the country. They're wanting to brighten their day. We've had really nice customer feedback about the animals and how the children are just loving that. And really, honestly, we've had all ages come out and book reservations. And come out and get your own pumpkin. This year we have a food truck, of course, too. So they have funnel cakes and corn dogs and all kinds of yummy food. So we've even had people come out here this year just to eat. <laughs> come on out and have you know a good time with your family you know we we take recommendations all the time like last year we didn't have benches and everybody was like we need somewhere to sit while our kids are playing so you know we try to take any you know feedback that we can as well so that you know everybody can have the best time out here overall it's been a really good season uh busy and and we've been rolling i feel like it at least gives kids something to do a safe place for kids to come out and play and you know, wears them out too. Our kids sleep good at night after we're out here. <laughs>